Hey guys, I want to welcome you back to the Sensu Pop Channel for another gameplay video on Tabletop Simulator. This is gonna be BT17 Ultimate Squad. This is a game between one of the anticipated decks. I think two of the most anticipated decks. First one, it is gonna be Metacula, hashtag 59, Metacula, hashtag 69. Uh, McMelvins, ha 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 ha, and uh, it is gonna be the it's gonna go up against Goku GT. So, how all these games are being played, it's on Tabletop Simulator. And take note, this is not the highest level of gameplay, it is more on um, just showing you how the mechanics of, of each deck works. Let's talk about Meta Cooler first, all right? So, Meta Cooler, it's this very swarmy deck in just a very funny way that you swing just multiple times if you are against this guy if you do not have board wipe and if you have not have floodgate control you are dead you're basically dead he is so efficient as that it is like similarly in a movie right where he can just multiply him several times several times several times and that's how he swings 15k 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 so your violent ray is not gonna do anything over here so when it comes to goku gt what is the deck all about the goku gt gt deck it also does have multiple swing. It does have a lot of control. So for example, the trunks, it comes out to play. It's 10K, minus 10K. The Goku four drop, minus 10K. There is so many ways to build this. I think you can go up with the multiple swing route with Pawn just to increase the multiple swing uh, thing, or you can do triple flash, right? The reason is very, very simple. When it comes to this deck itself, um, it does have quite a lot of support for all cards. That that unison, it is gonna be very, very important. But you know you start playing with that unison and uh, it's a 15K, it cannot swing. If it can swing, I think it's a little bit broken because the unison is gonna stay on the board unless you have a way just to remove unison, not Marcus, remove unison, the unison is gonna stay on the board. Take note, this is turn one. And it is gonna go up to, I think, if it does a plus zero, it, it goes up to uh, straight five. Already, turn one. Turn number one, it has already five marker. Oh, actually, it's six because to put that card underneath, it gains an additional marker. All right? So. <laughs> That's how it is. All these cards that you put in a spaceship, they can come out from the drop, uh, from underneath the spaceship to be played. It's 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 very cute and very amazing. All right. So 15k swing, two energies open. How much swing can Meta Cooler get just for two energy? Now the leader swings. He takes a life, and then you burst one, up burst two, and after that you go to attack, and then you play a uh, infinite multiplication in active mode. I hope I got that correctly. I think it is in active mode. And then I try to read it so many times because, you know, it, it feels like it cannot be, right? It cannot be. It swings so hard. And uh, yeah, I think it's really th that amount. <laughs> yep. And you burst and all this meta cooler in your drop area, they will come out. Th th you can play. I think with five energy you can play up to 100 of them <laughs> from your drop area so that's how powerful it is all right and uh, that is a bus too i forgot to burst and um that fuel card tap one you tap the fuel card you are burst one and then you go to your deck and you play out another meta cooler so this is a one energy play take note take a look at the board you have a 10k swing two times 15k swing and then there is another 15k swing, so uh, quite a lot of damage. I think it's really good that Goku GT, what he does, it's that he combo out of the 10k because he knew a lot of 15k it's coming his way. So take note, when you're going up against Meta Cooler, they do not have barrier, they do not have deflect, they, uh, they are very, very, very prone to bot, uh, bot wipe. So especially a bot wipe like Goku, like Red, which is choose all of your opponents and just minus 10k or minus 15k, they're very prone to that. Yep. So, okay, here we go. Goku GT, what is he going to be doing? When he swings, put a same card underneath the uh, unison and you draw two. Amazing. You have to put a Saiyan card, which is totally fine. Draw two because all most of the cards you are able to play from the uh, from the uh, spaceship itself. So inside there's trunks, inside I think there's pawn. They are free play. Pawn, it's a blocker. Okay, 
Here we go. Awaken seven or more. You can awaken. That's really good. You draw two. This is a draw two leader. Um, would I be happy with untap one and draw one? Yeah, because this leader already draws a lot. I, I find myself drawing a lot with this leader when I'm playing a Goku GT. So maybe untap one, draw one might be better. We don't know. Let's see. Uh, all right. So here we go. Um, guys, let me know down in the comment section. Also, how are you? First one, how are you enjoying all these games on uh, Tabletop Simulator? Second one, do you? Um, what are some of the decks that you really like to play, right? Uh, for BT17, for me, I'm trying to make a cooler deck. Ah, uh, but it's just so unfair. Uh, because I bought the Golden Freezer. I think the Golden Freezer units that got really expensive. I bought it and uh, the price went up. And guess what? When price went up, those big shops, they ship. But uh, I bought it from a seller that just told me that, you know, some excuses. And he said, oh, he has to cancel it. <laughs> so, oh, that's... Okay, so here we go. He taps one. Play it from underneath the uh, unison. Comes out when he's being played. Choose one of your opponent's um, battle card and it gets a minus 10k. And tapping one. Okay, evolve on top just to get them extra minus 10k. The activate main limit one comes from the play from unison. But you can actually evolve on top of it just to get a minus 10k. Just so you minus something uh, and remove it from the board. He needs to do a little bit of board control. That's good. It comes in in rest mode though. But that's how the board is when you put it on top of the uh, board itself. There is a, there's a script, right? That just snaps it in. And uh, it has to come in that mode, uh, just for the zoning, the zoning uh, algorithm. Okay, so everything is untapped. Back to Meta Cooler. What damage Meta Cooler can do with three energy? Let's take a look. Um, the Meta Cooler two drop, the yellow and green. That's such a good card because it is the perfect energy for turn one. If you're a leader, it's a Meta Cooler card, or I think a cooler card, and you get to uh, play this for. Uh, without energy exhaust that means you already have like a yellow and also a green energy just for you to use this is more like a yellow and green deck yeah here we go swing take a life and then play a meta cooler the uh, we're, we're gonna awaken soon okay here we go yes Awakens, Meta Cooler Core, Unlimited Power. Yeah, I also put in some effort with this animation. Vroom, vroom, vroom. <laughs> yeah, here we go. Another Meta Cooler. Just tapping the... Um, did I? Yeah. So... Mm -hmm. He is gonna combo out of this. Okay. Yeah, trying to stay alive. Now he's just down to uh, five. And there is one, two, three. Three... Four more swings, including this one. <laughs> and okay, that's a negate. Okay, take a life and becomes a blocker. Okay, just for zero cards in your hand because you replenish this with your life, right? So you tank two attacks for this one. Another attack. Take note, Metacula, three energy open. So if you like this type of deck, I really recommend you just to play Metacula. It's Pretty, pretty cool. Several ways to build it. Um, but if you just want to build it like BT17, it, it will work. It will work. The the difference ain't that much. Yeah. In my opinion. Tapping to and playing this Meta Cooler enhance manners. This guy, it's a manners. Because when you play him, he is a blocker. He comes in. 5k blocker. Good. But he goes to the top 7 cards of your deck. And then plays 3. Up to 3. Infinite Meta Cooler. So there are two of them on the top seven. <laughs> Look at that crazy board. I'm not too sure when it comes to GT, is there a way? I think there should be, but it's the boss monster. It has to be the boss monster. The boss monster, kind of to play it effectively, you kind of need four energy because you need to have four energy to activate it. So Goku GT needs to survive another two more turns. Taking a look at the board, Violent Ray can't even help, right? Because Violent Ray just uh, stop anything that's 20k and above. These guys are all 15. I think the only way blue is perfect with just Sensu Beam. When it comes to Goku GT, 
there is one though the negate the three drop negate uh the bt3 negate that if your leader it's a red saiyan it gets an additional 5k i think that's great and the other one is the korean korean something like that that gives you the additional 5k for the bet for the duration of the battle so bring yourself to 20 the hand size of meta cooler is not that big so that is maybe the drawback when it comes to the meta cooler deck he can't swing if you're at 20 or it's going to be painful for him to swing when he's at 20. okay so putting putting one underneath da -da 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 -da. so live tally it's even right now four to four i know it's more than 20 but this is a d d, d 20 dice so uh yeah maximum 20 you you will not need anything anything that could remove that amount of marker uh most probably it's okay tapping to okay pretty good because when this guy comes out just for one energy he is he can swing for 20k but there is already um what do you call that uh dormant potential okay bring out a blocker that's great this lady awesome for two energy you can bring out any tr goku gt or any trunks that's 15k or less doesn't care about the um the energy cost 15k or less tap two it brings it out why is it important because you know if you want to play triple flash it on you can only triple flash on five drop goku this deck has no five drop goku okay there is a five drop goku that's 15k that is the da -da 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 -da. Don't, don't, don't wait for it i think that comes up from bt3 that when i think you're four or less life it increases on the board by 5k uh for two it's a three cost it becomes a five cost so you can actually triple flash and that's a 15k so with this lady on the board which is free play only spirit boost one you can tap two play the card then triple flash on top three energy 30k triple striker it has to be triple striker right triple flash okay so with four energy this is down to the wire now um first a block second swing okay just the good part when it comes to gogo gc is that it has a lot of hand size so perfect 15k 15k and tanking at 20 20 okay no combos from the meta cooler player meta cooler Oh, just said that no combo. So this is 25. Oh, he's going to take the damage. Now, um, ev everything on the board has swing. Uh, three, three energy. Here we go. Boss monster. Bam. Look at this animation. <laughs> Metacula, the collective. This guy himself, when he comes out, you can do it as successor. When you do it with successor, if you pop most four or more Metacula, for your successor, which is eight, you get to replay them from your drop area. So now, not in rest mode, in active mode. So now there is another form of swing, 15k. If you don't have sense of being, if you don't have the, the, the Korean card, or you don't have the negate that gives you the additional 5k for the duration of the turn, yeah, it's it's gonna be really, really difficult. Here we go, the first swing, still comboing, but this time around you can see he's a little bit desperate when it comes to Goku GT using super combo to combo out of a 15k swing not very very ideal i think he's just trying to draw some cards another swing <laughs> 15k okay so three more another swing all this pressure it's very important you said hey meta cooler player it's not putting in all this pressure to combo the reason is simple it's down to three i don't think there's a lot of pressure here and Metacula can defend pretty well with dormant potential. So at four, he is still it's okay. But all this swing is to make his opponent drop cards, reduce his hand size. All right. And uh, okay, so putting in, bam, this guy, a Silopian guard, mass production model. It is a free blocker. And he's not going to swing with the 8k because there's already a blocker on the board. Swing with the 8k, uh, 8 cost card uh, doesn't make sense. Because it, it's going to block anyways. But maybe reduces your plus 5k because with that 
with um, with the uh, with with the negate with the token for Cyberman, that is a zero plus five k. I think the only one that doesn't have it is Freezer Army, yeah. the yellow one. You don't even get a zero plus five k, but it's a zero plus. It's a 10k, so you can technically kind of swing if you just minus one card from your hand. For energy. Okay, do it. Yep, bring out the um, 8 drop. So if you said, if you want to play GT, oh, here we go. So 8 drop, SS, Sun, Goku. When this guy comes out, you can do a spirit boost 3. You have a lot of markers anyways. Um, everything on the board, I think it's a minus 30. Yeah, total destruction. Except for the big giant meta cooler because that is a 30. Yep. And now this guy, it's a triple, triple strike. So I think right now he is a 35k triple strike. I hope I see this correctly. Can't see properly though. So down to four. Let's see if he has dormant potential. That is the card that's gonna save him. He doesn't. <laughs> oh no. There's like one swing, two swing, three, four. Four swing, one it's a one is a monster. I would say that what he wants to get in is a reduce. Oh my god. So this is this is the one from the starter deck. It's really good for this deck because it can EX evolve for just uh, one energy discard one card and it becomes a 30k. That guy swings vanilla 30k, 40k. See? So easy, right? Just for one energy swing 40k. Meta cooler 45k. 45k. Okay, he's gonna take it. Down to triple strike range. Here we go. Does he have a negate for the triple strike? 30, 30 or 35, 35, maybe 30, 35, let's do 30, okay, 35, 40, 45, 50, 50, 50, triple strike, Kula, does he have any answer for this? He could have tapped that one just to play that block it. Oh, it's gonna die anyways. Oh, okay. <laughs> Invaders Valve, this is finished. It's finished now, it's finished now. So, uh, he has so many meta coolers, so many unison, so many meta coolers, it doesn't care anyway. So, uh, yeah, so he can choose the eight drop, bomb it, and his opponent has to discard two cards, activate battle. That, it's a very, I've seen this in real life. Uh, I already bought it, by the way. On, card market because I want to make the cooler deck right this card is amazing for the deck itself it looks amazing the foiling is just impeccable uh, but if you're playing it for the battle uh, activate battle so if your opponent goes for it it does not ignore barrier but if it ignores barrier it is amazing but um, just like that it can win shoot again all right so hey guys I hope you like. Uh, I hope you like what you see over here. If you enjoyed the video, I appreciate it. You can give this video a like, subscribe if you want to support me and the channel. Stay safe, stay healthy, enjoy playing the Dragon Ball Super Card game. I hope you guys are okay. See you guys in the next video. Ciao, bye.